All right, ladies and gentlemen. You see this little man right here? This is Justin. Justin just got in eating breakfast, so he's a bit of a mess. Um, I haven't uploaded a video in a very long time. Unfortunately, I broke my camera. I have been doing a lot of stuff, and I had a baby. Um, my fiance and I are doing pretty good. Things have been fun, but life has been very hectic. I, uh, last two videos I think I put up, I talked about wanting to post more, wanting to be more active on my YouTube channel, and that kind of just <laughs> didn't happen. So, sorry about that. But, um, we are a year old now, as of the 10th of May. Um, and my cat just thinks she needs to be in the video too. Um, life's been very different lately. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to keep up on the YouTube channel. Um, it's kind of died. I've lost almost all of my subscribers. <laughs> um, but that kind of happens. Say hi to the people. Say hi. Samoa, get down. Oh, fine. Okay, now the cat's in the video too. All right. I have four dogs. I have two cats. And I have a baby. And I work 10 hours a day. I do get weekends off though, but. Yeah, this is your kitty. It's a kitty. Cat's not too fond of the, of the baby, at least not when I'm holding her. Um, he tends to kind of like shake her to death. <laughs> but um, I do have some stuff planned. I do plan to put something out there for you guys. I've got a couple projects in the works. Um, this little guy. This thing rips a little two and a half inch here with a diatone build off and then um, some eight blade props. This thing's gonna be gnarly. Um, I think I already put up a review video of the Darwin FPV baby ape, or tiny ape, sorry. And, um, oh, it is baby ape. Um, but I've updated this thing. I've put a couple upgrades to it. Um, I managed to install a run cam split I've got five blade center props on it. Uh, these are, I believe, three inches. Yeah, three inches. Um, so you'll get to see some video on this. It's got an HD video outputter now. Um, well, yeah. HD for analog. But um, we've gotten rid of almost everything stock on this, minus the flight control. So the flight control is actually really good. Um, this is going to go into a new setup. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you want to touch it? Yeah. There you go. Yeah. He likes playing with the controllers and everything. Um, he's probably going to be a gamer. We don't know yet. But um, yeah, life has been life has been a little weird. I'm I got a Cinewoop build coming. I'm going to do a walkthrough for the Ishin Civitar 182, I believe. A three inch swoop, um, or three inch Cine drone, however you want to call it. Cat, yeah, you're going to catch me. Eat. And, um, yeah, so there's a couple things going out there. And then I think I'm going to do a giveaway for this frame. This is a three inch frame. Uh, it's like an older Darwin FPV model, but it's got a, I guess it's 3.5K, but um, it's said it's 4K uh, carbon frame, but it's definitely three and a half. Um, you can have that one too. TPU printed parts on it, everything that you could need. Um, receiver, antenna, all those little mounts on it. It's a cool little frame. Um, cost me like $30 a little while back. I have no use for it. So um, if any of you want to be on the receiving end of that frame, um, I'm gonna put a link below. I haven't done any giveaways before, but I figure what the hell, why not? I've had this YouTube channel for 10 years and <laughs> I gotta do something to make it go again. So, if you guys want this little frame, you can do whatever you want with it. Mount it on the wall, make a, co make a coaster out of it or something, I don't know. Or actually use it and fly it. Um, it's got four point mounts, so anything in like the 1806 and up range will, will work on this. Um, again, with the 4K carbon frame, it's super strong. I flew it, I tried to do a test review video on it, but like I said, I broke the camera. Um, it took a beating. It really did. I don't see any cracks. I don't see anything on it. Um, and I'll leave a link for it um, for the Amazon page. 
uh, I think it's a lot cheaper now. I think it's only like 20 bucks now. Um, and some other brand bought it, so it's not Darwin FPV anymore, but it's still a good frame. And I like it, it's pretty light. Um, I think it's 24 grams um, for the whole thing, hardware and all. So yeah, that'll happen too. Um, other than that, not much has changed. Um, I've upgraded my radio, and for some of you guys, you might not think this is an upgrade, but uh, I've got a Turner Z9X light now. Um, but I used to run, or X9 light, sorry. I used to run a Turner Z9X. Um, very old radio. Um, and I have modules for it, but it's one of the first module radios to ever come out. And uh, now there's a massive range difference. There's a lot of response difference. Um, ACCST, so it's faster access if I want to, but I don't really use that because I run excellent place receivers pretty much on everything. And uh, yes, I'm still analog, guys. I know. But with the new setup on the Baby 8 with the run cam split and everything, it's all 1080p. It's 60 FPS. Hopefully you guys are getting some good video out of it on the back end. Um, and yes, all that does fit inside this frame, which is really cool. Um, I didn't have to drill anything or modify anything. It all just kind of bolted in there. Um, well, you can't really see it. So this is a really cool frame once you get it set up. Um, people kind of hate on these baby apes. Um, but $100 is an entry level drone and they're very, very fun to fly. Um, you can have it, you know. And I trust it enough that I can let my son beat on it. Um, the arms are replaceable, which is cool because they will break. The only thing that you have to worry about is the little LED strips. Um, yeah, it's a drone. It's a drone. Um, I fly it really aggressively. It's, uh, it's very responsive. It works pretty well. It's only 3S though. Um, this guy is 4S, which is this, I mean... 5,500 KVs on 4S is a lot, um, but you'll get a video for that soon. Um, only thing is this is still analog on the uh, video. I don't have any HD anything. I don't have any onboard recording or anything like that. So we're gonna fix that. Um, I'm gonna get a new run cam split, uh, probably the run cam split 4K. Um, and then all of this is gonna get some new motors. Um, I got some 4,300 KV 6S motors um, and it's gonna go in my Civitar and we're gonna get that thing a rip to see how it goes. Um, get some nice, cool, smooth flying out of it. Um, it's got a Mamba F3 stack on it, so. F3, F4. F4 stack, I like. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Life has been pretty crazy, so I'm sorry I haven't been active. Um, this guy takes a lot of work, but honestly, it's been a great experience having a baby. Yeah, I have some people have got some horror stories, but. You need a high five, me four. It wasn't a high five, me. You can do it again. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Yeah. You want that? Yeah. yeah, okay. We're in the teaching phase. He's a year old. Um, as I said earlier, his birthday was on May 10th. It was pretty cool. Um, we had a nice party and all that stuff, but um, it's been a lot. Life has been changing. So I'm going to get back on. I'm going to stop rambling, and um, hopefully you guys will get uh, get some more content coming here soon. He's old enough now where I can get a babysitter and I can do some things. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Sorry for blabbing, but I figured you guys could use at least some sort of an update for the 12 of you I have left subscribed to the channel. <laughs> but, you know, you don't update for a year. It's kind of what happens. Anywho, thanks a lot. Later.